Good morning. Um, thank you so much for doing this. Um, my name is Lisa French. Almost 49 years ago, a little baby girl burst onto the scene at six and a half months. The mother, it was her first child. She was home alone with only her mother-in-law, who had had three children, and a 12-year-old boy. That 12-year-old boy was my uncle. That woman giving birth for the very first time was my mother. That mother-in-law was my grandmother. And I was that six and a half month old child that was not due to come on March 22nd. I was due to come on March, on May 31st. My mother's water broke. She said, I have to go to the bathroom. She proceeded to walk to the bathroom. My grandmother went, wait a minute, I know what's going on. Doris, lay down, you're having the baby now. It's too soon, I know it's too soon. Lay down, you're having the baby now. <laughs> there was a, a song, this was 1970. There was a famous song, she came in through the bathroom window. This is embarrassing, I can't believe I'm telling you this. The family joke is, is that I came in through the bathroom window because my mother was laying on the floor with her legs facing the bathroom window and my grandmother delivering me. I was almost born in the toilet. If it weren't for the fact that my grandmother delivered me, I would have been born in the toilet and I probably would have drowned. This dress, this doll that I have, my grandmother gave me when I was about five or six, this dress was my dress when I finally grew into it. My first diaper was a man's handkerchief at the hospital because they didn't have a diaper small enough. You can't pass this bill. I was that premature child that could have been killed by abortion. If you pass this bill, then some little baby that gets born two and a half months early, that's not due for two and a half months, can be killed. Look at these hands. Look at these toes. I had all my fingers, all my toes. I had every body part. I was just too small. I had every single thing that I needed to be sustained for life. If you pass this bill, what you're saying is, well, Lisa, you and others like you are not viable. I was viable. When I was born, I wasn't moving, I wasn't crying. My grandmother thought that there was a stillborn. She wrapped me up in a blanket, and between her and my uncle, they're dialing, oh. They saw the blanket move, that's how they knew I was alive. I was taken to the closest hospital, which was not the hospital that, my, that the doctor was at. I believe it was uh, St. John, and it was in Cleveland, Ohio. Again, this was 1970. I was two and a half months early. I weighed two and a half pounds. I dropped to 2.8. I was 21 inches long. I was not viable. Am I alive? Am I sitting here before you speaking? The answer would be a resounding yes, I am. So please, don't pass this bill. For the love of God, don't pass this bill. Thank you very much for your testimony. Any questions or comments?